welcome back to my channel. Um, today I thought that it would be a good day to do a vlog. It's 2019 or 2020, excuse me. I'm getting used to the new year. But um, I hope you guys, this 2019 was really good. Mine was. Um, and I thought I would like to do more vlogs. Now, I don't really have an excuse for not doing vlogs other than I'm super uncomfortable with being on camera. It's hard enough for me to do like time lapses and stuff like that. I'm trying to get over that. It's one of my goals for this year is to get over not wanting to take pictures and not wanting to do video and it's just a hard thing for me. I'm so jealous of people that are super comfortable being behind the camera and um, just putting everything out there for the world to see. I'm not at that point yet, um, but I'm, I'm working on it. So thank you for tuning in. Um, I hope this year will be a really good year as far as my YouTube channel goes. And um, I don't know, I have a lot of things in the works. So I'm on my way to my studio and I have some things to do. I have some, some paintings to sign and varnish and things like that. And I thought that I, it would be a good time to do like a vlog. So thanks for tuning in and we'll get to it. Also, I almost forgot my stepdad, um, he had asked me to do a fish um, painting for him and I wanted to get that done for his birthday. His birthday is today, so I'm running a little behind. I started this painting like maybe a few weeks ago, so I'm going to do some varnishing, I'm going to do some signing, and I'm also going to have a time lapse of that painting from start to finish. Um, like I said, I, I started it like maybe maybe a month ago and then I got busy with doing commissions and stuff like that so I want to get that done for him today and hopefully I can get it to him tomorrow. I feel bad that it, it wasn't ready for his birthday today but hopefully he'll forgive me because I'm so great. So without further ado, let's get to it. I had this stamp made for my um, canvas panels whenever I do those so I usually stamp those on the back. Um, before I sign. And to do my signature, I use a, um, it's like a pink pen. It's just easier for me to sign with that. I do need to practice um, signing with a brush, and I'll do that. But, um, well, I do that sometimes, but I like to just use my um, pink pen to sign. And then I also put the title on the back of the painting, side of the painting, and then my signature again. I've mentioned before the type of varnish that I use and it's by Liquitex. It's a medium in varnish. So far I like that. I haven't tried any of the um, like spray paint, the, the spray varnishes yet. I don't know if I will, but um, so far I just like the Liquitex. Um, I'll leave a, if, if, I'll leave a link for the type of varnish that I use in the description box, I guess, or you can email me if you need to know the, um, the brand or anything.
Varnishing is like my absolutely favorite part of the painting process. Um, it just, I don't know, it just makes the painting feel complete once it's varnished. Like, I, I love using a gloss, gloss varnish, so it just makes every painting look better to me once it's like shiny and glossy and pretty. So, I always use a gloss varnish. Thanks for watching.